Go. My eyes. <laughs> Come drink with us, stranger. Be welcome, Essir. Our father's hall is a heaven to all. I remember there was a cauldron here once, brought by Thor from Hemius Hall. A cauldron a mile deep, a mile of mead. I miss that cauldron. Father bet the cauldron on a foolish wager with Schutzinger and lost. But we still have the ale from our brewery. Where is Agir now? He's gone to Utgather. He sent a cauldron to Sutgungar, but it never got there, so he's gone to find out what's what. Oh, but enough of that. You are a visitor to our great land, and we know its secrets. Ask of us your questions. I want to know the unknown. Where should I look? There is a broken tower near Utgavr that was once a place of great magic. Perhaps there is still some to be found there. To magic! May we never be without it. Skull! Let us tell you more of our homeland. What animals will I find in the wild? I have heard tell of a great bear of stone and ice that lives by a frozen lake. Enough talk! Time for a drink! Skull! Let us tell you more of our homeland. <sighs> Spin me a tale of tragedy. Once, Thor dashed the great serpent Jormungandr against our shores. Many ships wrecked. Many Jotnar drowned. Seek a lonely tree of the shore and walk beneath it. You'll see. Now let us drink to the fallen. Skull! You don't look well. Is our ale taking a toll on you? <sighs> Tastes like a boar shed in my mouth. Where am I? I should... I should find out what I did while the ale addled. My mind is blank. Arrived with wine and vomit. Ah, uh, these are Thrall's clothes. Where did they come from? Hey, 
in Snortington demands tribute. Don't make us lock you up like we did your Aesir friend. King Snortington, the boar. Once a prisoner, now free. I think we even made up a song about it. To the mighty rivers of the ALC! The well, are we trying to sail somewhere? Across the ALC to the land of... Of... Uh, I can't recall it.
see you, old friend. <laughs>
This home was right here when I last visited. It may still be. Survey the area, Sunan.
do you see? Stretch your wings, Sulin. Definitely not good. I need your eyes, my friend.
Nietzsche's house. There you are. Enter. Do not trouble to knock or announce yourself. Angra Boda. I have traveled far to find you. And you are brave to darken my door alone. Where is my lover, the dark fox that slinks between my sheets? Loki has stayed in Asgard to help rebuild the damage from a recent attack. How generous. And entirely unlike him. You used to be much better at lying. I am not Loki's keeper. I've come to understand Jotnar magic, your method for moving Hugo from one body to another. The Mead? You seek the Mead? Hirokin! You have long outstayed your welcome. Then I will take my leave. But remember what I said, Angarbova. You will see things my way in time. The mead she spoke of. Where can I find it? A slip of the tongue. Forget what you heard. Do not play games with me, witch. You would sell any truth for the right price. If one had the means to pay it. There is a root called Hag's Claw. It grows at the bottom of a waterfall to the south, at the forest's edge. Bring me three roots from the place where the Red Moss thrives. Then we will speak of the mead. I will hold you to it.
should be nearby, but I see no sign of it. If I look about, I may yet find a way to see the unseen. Go, Zulin. This land hides its secrets well, but no secret is safe from me. Must be the hag's claw Engaborn I spoke of. A pungent root. It must be a hag's claw. There should be more around. strange down here. from this route turns my stomach. Yeah. Wars are closing in. 
grown by the smell of the root. I have done as you asked. Now, where is my wisdom? Give it a moment to brew. There. An elixir to ready your spirit. How will this bring me the meat? It will open your mind to the secrets of the world. While we wait, let us speak of Asgard. How fared your defenses after the last attack? We, um, we have been weakened. By treachery. Without time to rebuild, we... We may not withstand another attack. Wait. I, uh... I, I did not mean to say that. I... I feel... Strange. Hexclaw has a way of untying the tongue. <laughs> now. You have said you want the mead. But how badly? How much would you sacrifice to be freed of fate's shackles? Would you give your tongue... Your hand, your sight. I would. I would give all that and more. I would like to see that. Loki, what trickery is this? I have sapped your strength, Javi. And I will take your life if your answers displease me. Did you think I would not come for you after what you did to my son? Our son, Fenrir, a name I think you have heard before. Yes, in the final reckoning, the wolf Fenrir will be my doom. Now you know. Now you can no longer deceive. Tell me, what will you do with him? I want to kill him. But I cannot. I swore an oath to you, Loki, and I will not break it. I will not take his life. Fenrir will be imprisoned until the day of prophecy, when we will meet upon the field of battle, as we are fated to. Then we will bind you until that day, as you mean to bind our son. An eye for an eye. I see she let you live. 
You must have done something right. <laughs> Let me help you down from there. No! No! Wait! 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 No! Ah! You could have let me down gently. That would presume I cared for your comfort. Then why release me at all? For the same reason you are in Jotunheim. You seek the mead, and I can help you get it. I assume there is a price. I want a small sample for myself. The rest is yours. Fair? Do I have a choice? Of course you do not. The mead is kept by Sutunger and his daughter Gunlother in the vault at their home in Utgardr. The vault is opened only on occasion of a great feast. When Sutungur shares the bounty of his cellar... And it would be a poor host who did not throw a feast for a distinguished visitor. Say, the High One of Asgard. You are not as ox-witted as I feared. I must bring a mighty gift to Sutungur, if I am to earn my welcome. That idiot drunkard Agir recently lost his cauldron to Sutungur in a wager, but it disappeared on the way to Utgardr. Sutungard would be grateful indeed if I returned that cauldron to him. Seek the tree that wears the scars of the World Serpent Scales. The cauldron would have passed by there. You might also bring a gift for Gunlother. There are treasures that would flatter her in Thrymmer's house by the lake near Utgardr. I will bear that in mind. When you have the mead, join me at the Well of Mimir. There, I will show you how to escape your doom at Ragnarok. Should I search for the cauldron now, or head for Thrymus Hall? Sunin, guide me. Here's the tree Hurricane mentioned. Its bark cut deep by Jormungandr's sharp scales. I should look around for the missing cauldron. Show me. Steel and flesh met here. But Jodna leave no corpses. Something huge was dragged this way. The ditch was dark so the cart would break a wheel. This was an ambush. This cart bears the sign of Agate. If, if it was Agir's cauldron they dragged through here, it must be large indeed.
The trail of destruction leads towards that giant root. of the great Jotun Skrimir dropped here long ago. Maybe the thieves took their burden inside. Soft moss all around. Hard to imagine this place once fitted a hand. <laughs> I should not be seen in this area. The missing cauldron. But how did they get it into this cave? That was not there before. Hard to know what is real in this realm of illusion. such cheerless squalor. It seems his sons have been hiding here, awaiting their chance to take it back.
as they seem in Jotunheimer. The cauldron has grown smaller. I'm getting the measure of these illusions. should be enough to win Sutungur's favor. I could go to Utgartha now, but a gift for Gunloda would improve my chances at getting the meat. Yeah. <laughs> 
slightly out here. Yeah. 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 Aid me, be my eyes. <laughs> Cast about this lamp, my friend. Have a look, Sunin. What do you see, Sunan? Thrymer's house once stood here, before ruin came upon it. the breath in your body. Loki often tells the tale of how Thrymia stole Thor's hammer. It seems his account of Thor's rage was no exaggeration.
Lord's bridal circlet. This would be a gift worthy of Gunlother's attention. None before. away and still in use by the looks of it.
none but the high one. Ratatusk the tree rat, what message do you carry today? I've received a new message just this morning. It says... Ratatusk is this girl who here shall run on the ash tree in Brazil. And the high one is he who will be crushed underneath my flighting skill. What say you, high one? I will take you on, Squirrel. Say when. Good. Let's begin. I'm a messenger born, and I have got a word here from up on high. You'll be slain and undone by my cutting wit. I should like to see you try. True, Tooth. I am named for the way I bite at the bark of the squirrel tree. But they ought call me knife tongue for words so sharp. They're too dull to conquer me. Not bad for an old man. I deal mostly in gossip, but hear say truth. Hearken to the words I speak. You're a fat-headed fool and a puny god. I'm not the sorry victim you seek. Awful! Awful! Ratatusk is the squirrel who here shall run on the ash tree Yggdrasil. Though he fought with some fury and did his best, it was Harvey got the kill. <sighs> you did better than I thought. Now leave this place before I bite. I'll find the key to this lock. Who has caged this Jotun? An Asir? It is a dire day when even enemies must be friends. But I must beg for your help. A hunter lives in a house nearby. He has become crazed, and now he preys on his fellow Jotnar. He has captured and beat my love, and soon he means to skin him like a rabbit. Will you have mercy and aid us? Where is this hunter? Inside the house asleep. Quickly! You must kill him before he wakes. He will have the key to this cage. I'll free you, I promise. I'll find the key to this lock. A door in a wall. Is this the house she meant? Well, that wasn't there before. Scum of Asgard! Trying to cut my throat in the night? Who <laughs> oh, guide my blows? Get out of my house! <laughs> Stop! Stop! Take what you want! Just spare me! I am no thief. I'm here to free the Jotun you have imprisoned. That villain? He's lucky I only caged him. How would you react if you found another man porking your wife? Your wife? Aye. I've been waiting for her return so I can thrash her. She won't be able to walk once I'm done. You have imprisoned her lover, and you mean to beat her when she returns? I think I'll just finish what I started. Then you shouldn't have let me catch my breath, fool! The key to the cage outside. A woman 
Hunter's hairbrush. Perhaps this hunter does not live alone. Scare me! Speak to me! It is done. The hunter is dead. Wonderful stranger! My everlasting thanks for saving me! Uh, saving us! Hurry now! Release him! You're free to go. My love... I knew you'd come for me. And your husband? Is he dead? You trouble us no more. Then we can claim the house that's rightfully yours, and begin life again. We rest a while first, though. Everything hurts. Hey, wait! Already dead, fool. Let's go! <laughs> 